the amazing world of the internet. Right? Now, let's just have a think about possibilities. Right? What are the odds? of everything being a lie <laughs> what are the odds of it come on what would the odds be Mr Bookmaker what are the odds that everything's a lie um, what are the odds so I can't even Calculate them because there is infinity. There is infinity. It's just the way, it, isn't it? What are the odds of everything being true? <laughs> eh? Fuck you now. Oh my god, oh my god. Anyway, Brian Harvey's found Jesus Christ now. So I'm happy. I'm really happy. <laughs> I hope it can be understanding to non believers, though. Well, I mean, if Brian Harvey's found Jesus, then Brian Harvey's going to heaven, eh? Might get beamed up. Might be one of the beamers. Raptured. I'm just so glad that Brian Harvey is connected with the Lord. And I'm so glad that it's something that we believe that we can just say, uh, all right, that's it now. I've found Jesus. What do you know about it? Absolutely. Fuck all. Why do you need to know something about it? Uh, it might be advisable. It might be advisable. Well, if you found Jesus and you found the Lord, it might be advisable to spend the rest of your life studying, might it? Let's do a bit, look, go and translate a bit of Hebrew. The King James and that have a scoot around. Check out who Baal is. Check out Abraham was a Sumerian. Looking to composite gods. I mean, if you've really found this knowledge, then you wouldn't need to be putting videos up because you would just completely say, 
That's it. Now I need to study on this subject. Oh, that was crap. And I've got faith in God, so I don't need to do a fucking thing. <laughs> you see what I mean? Brothers and sisters, do you see what I mean? I know it sounds fucking insane, like, but I actually trust Rebel Rhymes for being genuine far more than... It's in the, it's in the top ten, you know what I mean? Being a genuine, misguided fool, but, like, genuine, you know what I mean? Yeah? Yeah, I fucking do. Which is good, because that's why I spoke to him on the phone before he did this. Not me. But his comments are getting less and less aggressive. Uh, Jay Davis, just. I think they must just like keep her in a camper van. I think they must be like Elvis, they just. They sedate her for two weeks. And then, uh. Wake her up. She's up. Tits out. Alright, where's Cross one? I won't give him a load of shit now. <laughs> I love it. I absolutely love it. You've, you've entertained me more than. More. You've been so entertaining, Jay Davis. I'm so grateful. That you've been poking around and having a go. Because it's like... It's attention, isn't it? At the end of the day. I mean... What did they say? No publicity is bad publicity. You know. And Jay, to be quite honest, right... I think we all need to grow up, don't we? Me, Purple Pebble, Brother Si, Rebel Rhymes. Because we're all being childish, aren't we? But it's you, Jay Davis, that fucking seems to make it happen. Do you notice that? You know, you're always throwing in, like, you know. Some like crazy shit, like it's like, it's like I read, I don't even read them. I, I just glance and reply and just go, You're insane because I can't be asked reading what you do, honestly. To God, what I it's just what I mean. I did think you was like a super troll shell for the government, but now I just don't think you are anymore. Now I just think you just. Why no in a caravan? Lord to death, trying to get young old men involved with you, but none of them are interested. Because, I don't know why. You wouldn't interest me looking at your weird, tarty pictures anyway, but... Maybe you smell good, maybe you've got nice looking feet, who knows? Maybe... Maybe. No, I'm only joking, Jay. Just leave it out now. I mean, if you want to, like, comment on things that I'm saying, like, just be nice about it, right? And I'll reply to you and say, I'll wrap my point, your point, my point, your point. Right? I do not want um, to be arguing and fucking texting some fucking elderly woman. Bullshit, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, really, like, I'm really asked about what you've got to say anyway. Um, but, like, if they're like constructive, critic, you know, critic, whatever, whatever you want to ask me, right? But just stop doing it as if you're trying to fucking, as if you're in some war with me, right? 
Because it's bullshit. I'm not even asked about you, mate. I'm not asked about your snide comments. I'm not asked about, any, about anything you've got to say. I'm not interested. Unless they're like, yeah, right, well, Andy, have you heard about this? Look into that. Ra, 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 do da, do da. But you don't do it like that. You just like. I know you've ended up having a war. I know you were reaching out on the internet. I, I, I do recall that I spoke to you. I don't know what we said, but I do recall you. Right, you got in with sighing. This must be where Rebel Rhymes pops up from. I don't have a fucking clue, like, you know. Um. I don't know. But I'm definitely not your enemy. Really, not really your enemy. I'm only fucking having a go at you because you're having a go at me, so I just keep having a laugh and I'm going to go back. So. I'm not really asked about what you, you got nothing nothing at all about you. Not asked about you. Not think you're good or bad. I don't think anything really about you because you, you'll take this as an insult, but you seem hurt and that, you know what I mean? You seem lonely. I don't know. And you know, then you're saying you've got two houses and all that and you're fighting the system when you've got two houses. How many rooms have you got empty? And what are the what's the only situation like in your area? You thought about offering a few of them rooms out to the homeless. See, and th and there you go. You sound like you're full of shit as well, then, don't you? I don't know. Like you said, oh, you're only about like, fucking out. You thick? Cause like I'm right on the pulse. It's good. You know what I mean, that's why I became a barber, really. I meet all the people, I and mean, we'll be able to talk to them. But I'm not asked about you, Jay. I think you need to chill the fuck out, really. Um, I'm not having a go. You know, and this is what the, also, this is what the truth movement does, doesn't it? You get in with, you know, you know, you know whatever I mean, don't you? You know, you start talking and that. That's what gets said, you fall out. Have an argument, it's all over the airwaves, like so it doesn't really matter, and it's just text and crap. But the true reality is, right? I actually don't want to fall out with you, although I know we have, and I actually don't care. I'm not going to say you think the earth is flat because you said that you don't, don't you? But like, I don't care even that you believe in chemtrails. Right, I'd like you to not do, but I don't care that you do. You know, <laughs> you can have a Google hang out with me. I'll, I'll talk to you if you want. Get to the bottom of the problem. It's just that there's a lot of information going in our heads, you know, and we're getting caught up in our belief systems and paranoia. I know you think I'm an Illuminati New World Order shell, and I don't blame you. I don't. I've said that loads of times. I don't blame anyone for thinking that I'm a paid show off. The secret, whatever, magic. working for the Jews or whatever, you know what I mean? I don't blame you. I, I would think that. Well, I would. I would. I fucking would, actually, yeah, I think. It's a bit fucking... It's a bit... It, I know that I don't add up. But the only reason I don't add up is because I've actually done a lot of fucking work. 
you see. That's why I do what I do. And I still haven't got all the fucking answers. I wouldn't want them. I don't want fall out with you. I'm actually saying to you, if you want to chill and be right, I'll be right with you. I mean, if you want to comment and they're not, not nice and questions, we'll, we'll just explain. I don't mind that. You know that really, don't you? Really, you do you know that, don't you? You and Si and Purple can bury it at you. Rebel Rhymes, you, we can all chill the fuck out. All right? And uh, stop thinking that we are the internet war because we're not the internet war. That's what the internet wants us to do. Yeah, that's what it wants us to do. It wants us to do that. It's, it's happening with groups all over the internet. It's a, a beautiful mess. It's a right mess. All right? So, civil, I'll be civil. Stop having a stab at every cunt. And I reckon everyone will stop having a stab at you, sweetheart. Is all I'm saying. Alright. I've got to go. I've got to make some mask. I'm doing shepherd's pie. I know it's not a traditional Sunday fur, but add some mince there and I thought that's, that'll do. I didn't have to go into Asda the other night, did I? Because I couldn't be asked. Because I had my bed in the yard. I thought I'd get back. I had days at work. Jamie's been working this past couple. Uh, well, last week and he's going to be in next week as well. Right? He's watching. We're going to let him do an haircut next week. He'll be good. He'll, he's, he won't get better teachers, so he'll be fine. Yeah, and then that's where it's going to have to be because there's fuck all for him. Unless he takes injections off a of fucking college and spends 40 grand to become something. <laughs> fuck and, and, and these... A lot of time and then I made over. I'm not gonna go on and 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 on. And on. One.